Hello and welcome back to the Discovery Center. My name is Mr. Malcolm and today we're joined by Spidey. Now Spidey is a crested gecko or an eyelash gecko. So we call them an eyelash because of all of these little tiny crests right there on their eye. Now, <clears throat> they don't actually have eyelashes and they don't actually have eyelids either. The way he keeps his eyelids mo or his eyeballs moist is when he licks his eyeballs. So you'll see that periodically, but you will not see him blink at all. Now, this little guy right here is arboreal, and arboreal means he likes to climb on trees and live in the trees. Now, he has lots of different adaptations to aid him with that, and you can see one of them on his toes. So his little toes have little tiny claws that he uses to hook onto things with. He also has what looks like suction cups on his toe pads that we won't be able to see right now because he's busy using those. Now, <clears throat> crested geckos are really popular in the pet trade. Um, <clears throat> we actually got this guy because he was surrendered to us from somebody who didn't know how to take care of him. Um, because he wasn't doing too well, he decided that um, his home wasn't the best place and he gave him to us and we rehabilit re rehabilitated him here. Now he's doing a lot better and he's a lot healthier and happy. Um, but he did lose his tail. So this is commonly referred to as, ooh, there he goes, as a frog butt. So these guys, um, crested geckos, can drop their tail at any point and it happens sometimes on accident. What had happened to him is he was just left alone one night. He probably jumped and didn't make it and fell down and that's why his tail just fell off <clears throat> now spidey is really good at jumping which and really really good at climbing which is how he got his name but we're gonna take him off of this because it's a little dusty up there we don't want him to get any dust in his face so he primarily eats bugs we feed him crickets and we also feed him this mix called rapashi now, rapashi is ground up bugs and fruit. Really, really delicious. These guys aren't very vocal when they're calm, but they do have little tiny chirps or barks. They use these when they're in very high stress situations. Um, they weren't discovered until 150 years ago, and then suddenly all of them disappeared um, after 1967. They were thought to be extinct, but then they were rediscovered in 1994. So these guys very narrowly escaped being extinct. But I think I'm going to put him back in his cage because he looks like he really, really wants to jump on the camera again or jump on something. So we're going to let him jump around in his, in his tank. 